Sorry, someone's at the lamp. Can't you see I'm watching television, you silly woman? It's a guest. Shouldn't you get it? Uh, tell them I'm not home. I think they probably heard us talking already. Can't you do it? Just go. Oh, all right. Coming! Hello, Sahib. If you will rub the lamp, I will predict your future. And which one do you think I should use? Uh, rich and famous. They all want to be rich and famous. <laughs> you, my friend, will be rich and famous. Very, very rich and very, very famous. You will have uh, uh, massive riches and uh, untold fame. Thank you for visiting the lamp and have a nice day. They ought to hold him for a while. Did you turn off the microphone? Oops. Uh, sorry. Greetings, Sahib. You want three wishes, am I correct? Well, who doesn't? <laughs> it is to my eternal shame that all I can do as your humble temporary servant is to prognosticate your future, so start rubbing the lamp. I gotta keep it buffed up, you know. <laughs> Did I tell you to stop rubbing, Sahib? Now, as to your future. Mm, I see you making a great scientific breakthrough. Yes, you are winning the Nobel Prize because uh, you, you invent something the world really needs. Uh, a camel with three humps. <laughs> Looks nifty, goes farther, seats to uh, very, very good. <laughs> Congratulations, O oh exalted one of the mystic east. Don't overdo it, my friend. A simple bow is more than enough. Salam and see you next time. <laughs> Well, ooh, ooh, what? <laughs> oh, I'm catching 40 winks. This had better be good. Oh, oh, it's you. <laughs> you want to know the future, eh? <laughs> oh, okay. Just rub the lamp and I'll see what I can do. You call that rubbing the lamp, my friend? I said rub the lamp. <laughs> okay, then. Let's see the future. The future. I predict you will visit a magnificent world of adventure. You will cruise the jungles of the world. You will go on an adventure with a famous archaeologist. <laughs> and you will come face to face with a ferocious rhino. <laughs> the rhino on a stick at the Bengal barbecue. It is lip smacking good. <laughs> Am I a mystic sage or what? <laughs> Especially since the Bengal barbecue pays me a percentage. <laughs> Good night again, exalted one. Hello, Sahib. You wish to know the future, don't you? How about if I give you three wishes instead? <laughs> joking, I'm joking. Just a little genie joke. Okay, your future. <laughs> Give me a little rub first. Ooh, ooh, little to the left. Oh, oh, yes, very, very nice, very nice. Oh, let's see. Oh, this is exciting. Oh, you, my temporary master, are actually going to invent, propose, and win an Olympic event for the Sultan's kingdom. <laughs> is that amazing or what? Oh, I'm getting chills. Oh, 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 imagine you up there getting your gold medal, except you won't be up there getting a gold medal because the Olympic event you invent is... Ah, prepare yourself. Javelin catching. Ah. <laughs> Me, I prefer ping pong. Salam and have a nice day, my friend. Greetings, Sahib. You want to know the future because you are a seeker. Well, you know what they say. There's a seeker born every minute. <laughs> so rub the lamp and let's boogie. Let's see. 
Oh, this is fascinating. You, you, my friend, will have your very next magic carpet service at Ahmed's Garage. That's right. You'll take advantage of Ahmed's amazing Lubomatic Quick Lube Bay, just eleven ninety-five. Say the genie and the other lamp sent me, and Ahmed will tighten your lug nuts at no extra charge. That's Ahmed's Magic Carpet Garage, open Monday through Friday till five, Saturdays till five. So there you are, my friend. You say it's a commercial. I say it's a prediction. Hey, it could be worse. Last month, my sponsor was a fly-through falafel stand. <laughs> so, salam and come again soon, my friend. <laughs> no dealers, please.